So CEO Taku was last week and you know what? It was a pretty damn good event if I do say so myself. I just want to give a quick shout out to the Wawa employees because those guys were the real MVP of the event. I mean, they were swamped. You know, you had everybody coming in that lives in the area going to that Wawa. And then pretty much everybody who was at the event was going there because the lines for food and just to get to the registers were ridiculously long. So shout out to those guys. Those guys, those guys were the real MVP. You know, they carried the event. But yeah, everything else was pretty good. You know, I've had a lot of fun. Um, you know, I did my bootleg commentary for Nitro Plus Blasters. So be sure to check out Baron of Voice YouTube channel. You know, he was the TO for that. So, and uh, you know, I don't know if the mic picked up though, because it was pretty loud in the event, but hopefully it did. And you guys can see the whole stream there. And uh, yeah, there's also some offline Grand Blue uh, matches that we did. So you can watch that. Speaking of Grand Blue, I did pretty good, if I do say so myself. I made it to top 24, actually came in ninth place. Kind of ruined my 1 million subscriber face reveal. Um, you know, that kind of sucked. You know, I was really holding on to that one, you know, for 1 million subs. But, eh, you know what? It is what it is. So, you can see me uh, playing some Grand Blue. And, I actually, you know what? I'm, I'm pretty proud of what happened. I didn't get a medal, though. And that kind of sucks. I mean, I would have loved to have gotten a medal. But, honestly, my main goal was just not to go 0-2. And, and making it all the way to 9th place was just a little happy bonus. And uh, taking the game off of Axon, who is probably one of the best NA Grand Blue players, was uh, you know just a nice little little treat, you know, <laughs> the, little, the little strawberry on top of the cake. But yeah, other than that, the event was uh, pretty cool. You know, they had the classic arcade section. You know, they had stuff for uh, you know like Marvel vs. Capcom. They had some DDR. They had some Third Strike. And then in the adjacent room, they had like a lot of the anime games. So they had uh, JoJo. They had uh, Arcana Heart, you know, they had uh, KOF was over there, even though, you know, KOF is an anime, but that was over there. And then you had to walk all the way around to the main hall, which is where the Street Fighter VI, Mortal Kombat 1, Guilty Gear Strive, Grand Blue, those were those setups, so they were over there. Not a long walk like I was with Evo. I mean, to get to one side of Evo to the other, that was... a that was a pretty good walk. Uh, this one wasn't so bad, you know. It was it was a little bit of walking, but uh, you know, it wasn't so bad. Overall, would I go again? Yeah, most likely. I mean, it was a pretty good event. It's too damn hot in Florida, though. You know, especially for the end of September, it was like 96 degrees Fahrenheit. I mean, that's just crazy to me. I mean, I'm you know I'm from I'm from the north, so this time of the month, you know, it's about like 60 degrees, you know maybe maybe low 70s so it's nice and cool up here but down there it's still hot so you know i was dying i was dying over there but overall you know it was a good event and you know what if you're there and you, know, you see me you know walking about uh yeah you know they'll sign autographs I'll, I'll sign your autograph i mean it might not be uh might not be uh worth much you know but hey maybe someday